Novak Djokovic provided an unexpected response in his interview after victory in Astana Novak Djokovic unexpectedly referred to his childhood when asked what drives his mental strength in tennis. The world number 7 had made light work of Bodic van de Zandschelp with a routine 6-3 6-1 victory in just 71 minutes to reach the quarter-final of the Astana Open on the ATP Tour. Djokovic won last week's Tel Aviv Open in Israel and is making only his second tournament appearance in three months after his ban from this summer's U.S. Open. The Serbian's unvaccinated status meant he was unable to play at Flushing Meadows, or in the two Masters events in Cincinnati and Canada in North America's hard court swing. But he has returned in fine form and looks refreshed after an extended break from the court. And Djokovic so often praised for his mental resilience on the court, was unequivocal in his post-match interview when asked what has forged his fortitude. Childhood, he said. Growing up in Serbia, if you did grow up in Serbia you would understand. Djokovic was alluding to his tough childhood in Serbia, and he has previously opened up on the traumatic experiences he was forced to deal with while growing up in the war-torn country. Speaking to Graham Bessinger in 2020, he recalled being forced to hide in the shelter of his grandfather's apartment in Belgrade after NATO's bombings of Yugoslavia in 1999, when he was just 12. Djokovic continues to be a huge force in tennis at the age of 35, with his remarkable skill level still matching his unique mental toughness. And the 2022 Wimbledon champion is now on a 13-match winning run after he dismissed his latest opponent at the Astana Open. He has still not lost a professional match since he was defeated in the French Open quarterfinals in May. A rejuvenated Djokovic is now targeting a strong end to the season and can secure his place at the ATP finals if he wins the Astana Open. I definitely am physically fresh and mentally motivated to do well, he added. I obviously haven't played for three months in any official tournament before Israel. I served well to end the first set. In the second set I started to read his serve better and just started swinging through the court more.